Good morning, my beautiful soul tribe. This is BBT, Baby Boss Tarot. Um, I'm doing the monthly stalker series, so we'll find out who is going to be stalking you this week. Obviously, it is a prediction. Do not force it to fit. It's not your story. Only take what resonates. Okay, guys. I'm going to get straight into the reading. Here is the Pisces. Let's find out who's stalking you. And then I'll use the Zodiac Oracle to actually narrow it down to what star sign. Even though the star signs do come out in this reading. But that gives us a bit more clarity. Okay, Aries to Pisces. Who is stalking Aries this week? Who's stalking Aries this week? Well, Aries, the one that really jumped out. Somebody who stalks your social media. Let me just turn the light on. So, Aries, this person stalks your social media. Could have initial Z. Uh, someone who is shaved. It could have tattoos. Have brown eyes. They could have four children. Okay, and you've got a couple of messages here. I don't want you to reject me. You've got my ex stalks you. Wow. So this person's ex stalks you, Aries. Oh my. Alright, let's find out who this is. Okay. Let's see who stalks your social media, Aries. Who's stalking? Oh, we've got Sagittarius stalking your social media. I'll see, I won't, I won't take the planets, but I'll take um, the elementals and I'll take the star signs. Okay, is there anyone else stalking Aries social media? We've got a Capricorn and a Virgo stalking your social media. Of course, um, they could have these elements in their chart as well, in their natal birth chart. I don't want you to reject me. Who is this? Taurus doesn't want you to reject them. A Libra doesn't want you to reject them. Who else doesn't want Aries? I'm not taking that one. Mars. Although that could be a Scorpio or an Aries. Alright. My ex stalks you. An air sign. So you've got an air sign whose ex stalks you, which could be a Taurus. So Aries, if you've got an air sign ex, um, their ex Taurus could be stalking you, or your ex could be a Taurus and their air sign is stalking you. Whatever. Okay. Let's get a bit, a bit more clarity on this, shall we? I'm going to try and do a long reading, I think. Alright. So, who is stalking my lovely Aries? Bottom of the decks, Hierophant, Taurus. Have we got a Taurus stalking you? Alright, so who is stalking Aries and why? The Tower. I think you're going to find something out here, Aries. <coughs> oh yeah, some of the swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, doesn't have to be, but yeah, someone's been sneaky and deceptive here in, in stalking you. But the four of pentacles, someone's hiding, somebody's holding back. Seven of wands, this person is defensive, but this is going to cause a tower, either for you or for this person, when you realise that you're being stalked. Could be an Aries or a Scorpio, Nine of Cups at the bottom of the deck, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, you are somebody's wish fulfillment, that's why they're stalking you. And it could be juggling between you and a marriage, there could already be in a commitment with somebody else. It could be Aries, it could be a fucking anyone. <laughs> alright, so you pretty much got all the signs stalking you Aries, alright? Okay, let's get on to Taurus. Who is stalking Taurus? Who is stalking Taurus? Oh well. Wow. You've got a police officer stalking you, who could be a Sagittarius. You could have hazel eyes and they have daddy issues. Is there any more? Any more for Taurus? Yep. Okay. Initial F. A sturdy deferred... deferred de de I can't English this morning. <laughs> That's a joke me and my kids do. We don't say I can't speak this morning. We say I can't English this morning. Someone who's 30 to 35, someone with three children, and somebody with green eyes. And let's find out. Let's get some clarity for you. Let's get the star signs. You already have Sagittarius. Let's see if there's any more people stalking you, Taurus. Ooh, winter solstice at the bottom of the deck. Something may have happened on December 23rd. Okay, a bit more clarity of who is stalking Taurus. Who's stalking Taurus? Okay. You have Capricorn. You've got a bit of devil energy. Someone's a bit... <laughs> Someone's obsessed. You could have a Scorpio. Uh, you could have an Aries or a Scorpio and a Leo. Okay. All right. Uh, 
and Michael says get straight on to Gemini. Do you not want clarifiers? No. Okay. Apparently he just wanted Ari to get a clarifier. He'll let me know if there needs to be any more clarifiers. Okay, thank you, Michael. Right. Gemini. Who is stalking Gemini? Okay. We've got someone who is a smoker. Someone who's a retail worker. I've just heard cafe. Someone who works in a cafe. That came out very quickly. Initial J. Jane. James. Someone aged 25 to 30. Um, and you're going to show H, Harry, Hannah. You do have a message, Gemini. Someone who has scars. Could be a Leo that's scor uh, scorking you. <laughs> it's been a rough morning. Right. Could be a Leo that's stalking you, Gemini. And the message you've got was, I got scared, so I ran. Now I will chase you. So someone's going to chase you. Um, this week, your stalker is going to chase you this week. Could be a Leo. Let's just get a bit more clarity. Who else is stalking Geminis? Who else is stalking Geminis? You got a Taurus. Any air sign? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You got a Capricorn. And a Cancer is stalking you. Okay. Alright. Cancer. Instantly, my sense is going nuts. Guys, I have to say, I've got a lot of cancer friends, and as soon as I start the reading, at least one of them will pop up in my energy, and the light has just got brighter in here. That's confirmation for me. Okay. Right, cancer, who is stalking you this week? Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, oh, God, wood. Okay. Right, there we go. Got it. Okay, someone who is an entrepreneur, someone who owns their own business. This could be a waitress. A retail worker, someone aged 25 to 30. You have a message. I ghosted you out of fear be just because of how strong our connection was. Could be your twin flame you're dealing with there. Let's find out, Cancer. Give me more clarity, please, of who is stalking Cancer. <coughs> oh, someone doesn't want me to talk, Cancer. <coughs> You've got a Scorpio that's stalking you, a Sagittarius. Is there any more? I've just heard this could be a mother and father that's stalking you. A Pisces is stalking you. Anyone else stalking Cancers? Okay, you've got heavy earth, so any earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but you've got Virgo here. Somebody could have all of this in their chart or whatever. I just heard you've got high priestess stalking you. Watch out, guys. <laughs> okay. Alright, Leo, who is stalking Leo? Okay, Leo, Michael has asked me to clarify some of yours. Already I can see you've got a Gemini stalking you. Oh, that would be enough. Right, you've got a Gemini stalking you. Someone who's 40 to 45, initial L, initial G. Someone who's been in jail, he wants me to clarify that one. Uh, could be a Scorpio. Ooh, someone who is fertile. Someone is ready to have children. He wants that one um, clarified. Someone who's in the occult. So somebody could be doing black magic on you. Do you want that one? No? Okay. Okay, this could be a doctor. <laughs> I've just heard witch doctor. Okay, somebody could have a cat and they could be over six feet. Okay. Before I clarify those, let's just find out if there's any other signs. So you've got Scorpio and Gemini. Is there any other signs stalking Leo? You've got an Aquarius, a Libra, and a Cancer. <laughs> Popular Leo. <laughs> the sun at the bottom of the day and the moon. Wow, the sun and the moon. <laughs> so you could have another Leo or a Pisces or a Cancer. Wow. <laughs> Alright, let's clarify for you. Alright. So, Leo, this person has been in jail. What for? What has this person been in jail for? Let's have a look. Three of Wands and the Knight of Wands, the Ace of Pentacles. 
they could have been in jail for money laundering. We've got the in and out energy here. This is kind of a player energy, but with the Ace of Pentacles, this person could have been in jail. It's just got something to do with money. Or someone is about to go to jail. Something to do with money. They're waiting for their ships to come in. They're waiting on a payment. Someone's waiting on a payment and they could end up in jail. Well, this is why they were in jail. They were waiting for a huge payment that didn't belong to them. Okay, could be an Aries, Leo, or Sag, or Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You've got the King of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Alright. <clears throat> Let's clarify it's fertile. Who is it? Who is fertile? Okay, the person stalking you who is fertile, be mindful. They have many options. They could be trying to get many people pregnant. Especially if you're a Leo female, be mindful. This person is trying to spread their seed everywhere. Yeah, page of cups, six of wands and the page of wands. You're going to hear about this. This person is going to communicate about you, um, sorry, communicate to you that they probably want a family with you. They want children with you. They definitely want a victory, but this person is trying to uh, put their seed in quite a few different people. So be mindful, Leo, okay? All right, so this could be, again, you've got fire and water here, heavy. Yeah, you've got Aries, Leo, Sag, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, but this is someone who's literally trying to put their dick in everything because I am feeling that I'm speaking to a Leo female here and this person is literally trying to <laughs> get anybody pregnant. Or if it's the other way around, um, Leo men, this is someone who is literally going out just trying to get pregnant. Possibly for money, if that's why they were in jail because they just wanted money. They're possibly trying to um, have a child for more money and they're literally sleeping with anyone. All right, let's get off of that energy. I really do need to get off of that energy. Wow, give me one second, guys. I've got to light the payload. Is that... <clears throat> yeah, the person you're dealing with, Leo, the person who's uh, stalking you, I've just heard, trying to see if you're good stock. Uh, it's trying to close up my throat chakra right now, so... I've just got to light the payload, Santa. Give me a minute. Sorry, guys. I will get on to Virgo. Oh, it's not lighting. Alright, there we go. Alright, look at the payload. Alright, let's just do this over the cards. <laughs> right, let's get on to Virgo. Right, if anyone can timestamp, that would be brilliant for me. It would be a big help because I'm very busy. Alright, Virgo, who is stalking you? Who's stalking Virgo? Okay, it's just somebody who is unshaved. Could be an Aries stalking you. A football player. Oh, I've just heard a celebrity. Okay. Somebody could be um, a celebrity football player in your local area. Uh, initial C. Could have a bald head. Could be a Sagittarius. Initial D. David came out very quickly and also so did Donna. Okay. All right, Virgo. The uh, messages you got was family and legacy mean everything to me. I ghosted you out of the fear just because of how strong our connection was. Wow, soulmate, twin flame. All right, let's see. So you've got Sagittarius and Aries. Let's see if you've got anyone else, Virgo. Then I will clarify that one. So Virgo, I think I'm uh, between you and. Who else got this? I think Cancer got this, so I may have to do a bonus reading for Virgo and Cancer today. Okay. Who else is stalking Virgo? Who else is stalking Virgo? Wow. Okay, you've got an Aquarius, a Libra. <coughs> Ooh. Okay, the Libra didn't want me to talk. Alright, Mars energy. You've got Saturn energy. A Capricorn. Okay, let's um sorry, I just need to do quick clarifies on this. Who ghosted Virgo out of fear? Who ghosted them out of fear because of how strong the connection was? 
Right, could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sag, you got everyone out here. This is someone who kind of wants to, someone who knows that they were deceptive towards you, they know they've done you wrong, They because they ghosted you. Okay, they're holding back from you, and they can see that you are garbage. Okay. King of Pentacles, bottom of the deck, they do love you. Well, this is someone who wants to give you stability. This isn't it's, this isn't cups, so it's not exactly emotional love. This is someone who is stable, loving, kind, nurturing, and caring. This is a spouse as well. Oh wow, Virgo, they want a passionate new beginning with you. Oh, and they're coming in quick. You've got the world, and you've got the chariot. Now, with the chariot coming first, and with the Ace of Wands being out here, Virgo, someone's literally going to come in and hit it and quit it as quick as they can. Alright, so be mindful of that. And this is the person who's stalking you, so it is someone you have been connected to in the past. Could be an ex, it could be a soulmate or a twin flame. It's someone who ghosted you. Alright. Okay. Right, who are we on now? Libra. Alright, KSL. <coughs> Libras. Libras, you can... <laughs> got a stalker they're running away no wow somebody with blue eyes is stalking you libra Keep them off. Oh. all right so somebody with blue eyes this could be an aries a football player uh, again you've got a twin flame here i ghosted you out of fear just because of how strong the connection was I was influenced by toxic people to avoid you. They told me lies about you, and now I know the truth, and I'm sorry. All right. This could have initial L. Could be an Aquarius. Someone who is shaved and a millionaire in the making. All right. Let's get some clarity if there's any more. Any more. Somebody in the Jupiter energy. A tall, sorry, a Sagittarius and an Aquarius. So you think you've got Aquarius twice there. Is there, let's just go, is there any more for Libra? Is there any more for Libra? Any water sign? Cancer.